what? <sighs> what is your problem? Let me sleep. Ericsson had this key on him. It belonged to Captain Gregorius. Ericsson, the miserable pox rash. He must have stolen it off one of those disease-ridden whores. You'd better pray they gave him something that'll kill him before I do. Here is your casket. You found it? Anyone see you fetching it? No one important. Strangely, that doesn't put me at ease. This casket is heavy. I'm guessing I brought you more than clean shirts. Maybe shirts and the gold the Inquisition is looking for? Could be. Or it could be my shirt buttons are just extremely heavy. Could be. A lesser man would have forced the lock to find out. I gave you my word. And a man's word is worth more than gold. Though gold never goes amiss. What say I throw 300 gold your way? Then it would be rude of me to turn it down. Stranger or friend, a decent deed is worth a decent reward. And? What about Romanov's gold? Have you found anything? Nope. Not yet. I thought as much. The task was obviously too difficult for you. Now, unless you have good news, leave me to my job. Who is your leader here in the town? We have an old storeroom in the rear of Madame Sonia's brothel. You'll find him there. Good. Not right now. Garth's working with Cutter. Cutter? He lets us pay him so we can work in peace and then he steals from us. That bastard had sucked bog bodies if he thought there was money in it. What about the packages? Did he have them on him? We need those packages. Here are the packages you wanted. Good work. A lot of gold is coming your way. Come on then. Tell me how to fleece the merchants. Right. There are two worthwhile targets. There's Conrad, the goods merchant. He buys from the farmers and sells at a big profit. And there's Alvaro, the weapons dealer. Since the only smith in the town works for him, he dictates the price of weapons. How do I collect from the two merchants? First, get an overview. Talk to them. Perhaps even buy something. You have to find out what's keeping them busy. What problems they have and what weaknesses. We know their weaknesses. We can use that against them. I discovered that Alvaro has a blade staff in his cellar that his prize customer really wants. Sounds like an opportunity. I assume that Sid and Delgado have taught you the necessary talents for removing objects. Well, if not, you should catch up. Get a bit of advice from them. And what do I do with the blade staff? You'll give it back to him, like any upstanding citizen would. Of course, not without pocketing an appropriate reward. And Alvaro will play along with that. He's a businessman. As long as you aren't too brazen, he'll consider it.
Here. Is this the Don's amulet? Hey, you found it. I have to say I doubted you. Thought you were another collaborator. But not anymore. You've done us both a favor. I'll make sure you're rewarded. What will you do now? I'm staying put. I need to think. And I need to watch Hernandez. Have fun. I gave Weasel the packages of Bruegelweed. So, you decided to help rather than hinder him. The Don's men have finished the Inquisition rules here. You've picked the losing side. Tony has the Don's gold amulet. Yeah, and I'm the winner of the Harbour Town Prettiest Arse competition. I didn't believe you before, and I'm not about to believe you now. So piss off and stop flapping your mouth at me, will you? Can you help me? I need to know where Conrad's cows are. He has them in an enclosure at the rear town gate. He has a farmer garden. I don't know his name, but he looks tough. All the cows are Conrad's, apart from my Elsa. At least they've spared her so far. This lock is too difficult. What? If you want it, I've got it. If you're here to buy, welcome. If you're here just to look or to beg, get out. I'm trying to run a business. Do you have any work going? I already pay enough workers. More would bleed me dry. Can you spare me a little gold? Get out and stay out. Show me your goods. So, you won't let Tilda into your house? Did she tell you that? The old witch. I give her food and room and all she does is whine. Why don't you just let her sleep inside? 
It's no business of yours who I let in my house. What's that stench? What? I don't smell anything. I have only top quality goods. What are you trying to do? Drive my customers away? Must have been something from down the street. You'd better not be trying to nick anything. I heard comrades swearing at you. That bastard only cares about gold. At least now, he knows what it's like to lose something. I heard you lost Marcelo's staff. You'll be interested to know I found one. Just found it, did you? Wasn't it my chest, was it? It's a staff, and it's yours. That's what I'm saying. You rot worm. You're asking me to pay for my staff. See it as a reward for me finding it. You're a piece of work, you are. Pretend to care about Walter. You're just interested in yourself. It's just a bit of gold. Add it to your next deal. And to think I thought you were all right for an outsider. Oh, and I'll need a little more. For expenses. And that's the end of it. I'll also need a bonus to stop this happening again. What? I'm paying you to stop you stealing from me? Think of it as insurance. I don't know what to think now. And I'll need a small amount to stop word of this getting around. I don't care if word gets around. In fact, I wanted to. People should know you robbed me. Get out of my house. Conrad keeps a couple of cows at the rear town gate. Good to know. And? He has the cows watched by a farmer. Then take a look around there. And talk to this farmer. Just found it's a you. You're a see it. You're a it's just and to oh, and, and that's the end. I am, or I'd have asked you for a lot more. Just sling your hook. Just f it's you, you're up. 
See. You're a piece. It's just. And to. Uh, and that's the. Uh, what? I think. I don't know. Uh, I don't. People should know. Get out. I heard you lost Marcelo's staff. You'll be interested to know I found one. Just found it, did you? Wasn't it my chest, was it? It's a staff, and it's yours. That's what I'm saying. You rockworm. You're asking me to pay for my staff. See it as a reward for me finding it. You're a piece of work, you are. Pretend to care about Walter. You're just interested in yourself. It's just a bit of gold. Add it to your next deal. And to think I thought you were all right for an outsider. Oh, and I'll need a little more. For expenses. And that's the end of it. I am. Or I'd have asked you for a lot more. Just sling your hook. I can't help you anymore. Conrad keeps a couple of cows at the rear town gate. Good to know. And? He has the cows watched by a farmer. And take a look around there. And talk to this farmer. I'm sure you have things to deal with. What do you want? <laughs> I don't like you being in it. Watch yourself. <laughs> I needed a good laugh. Uh, hey, come on! Uh. Uh. I'm done. I'm done. What now? <laughs> Leave everything alone.
something happen? I give up. I give up. <laughs> <laughs> I, what do you want? <laughs> oh, you're a right joker, you, aren't you? I found it. I have your ring. I'm so pleased that honesty still exists. I'd like you to keep the ring. Are you serious? Seeing it just reminds me of the break-in. I don't want it anymore. Are you sure about giving me the ring? Isn't it precious? Yes, of course. I don't even want to look at it. Take it with my thanks. I'm grateful. Thank you. So you guard cows? Yeah, and feed and milk them. Berta here is the best cow we have, aren't you, old girl? She's a grand milker, best on the island, a real bovine beauty. No wonder Conrad wants me to guard her. I can see you're very proud. I'm sure you have plenty to do. Go! Ah, after no. him! Hey! You killed Berta! I'd keep quiet about that if I were you. You lousy cow killer! What am I gonna do for a job now? That's not my problem. Murderer! Cow murderer! You won! You won! Don't just stand around. Be off with you.
What do you want? Hey! Leave our livestock alone! Uh, after them! I don't feel like talking. You killed a perfectly good animal. Nice one. Conrad has a favorite cow, a really good one, Berta. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Probably not. I'm sure he would miss Berta, and a dead Berta will remind him of his own mortality. Conrad won't be sleeping alone tonight. <laughs> Better find that a moving experience. I'd stake my life on it. All right. Now, let's give him a little time to grasp the situation. When should I go back and see him? No hurry. Rest. See Sonia. You've earned it. Then you can visit Conrad. I need some rest. Your brother, Ulf, wants you to go to your meeting point. Thanks. I'm on my way. do need information. I'm all ears. What is the situation like in town at the moment? Esteban's men seem to be gaining the upper hand. That's good for business, but I doubt it will last long. The Inquisition seem to be gaining new members by the day. Do you know where I can find Don Esteban's captain in town? His boys sent me to see him. Hmm. Are you sure? You'd better be else you won't be coming out again to tell the tale. Scordo's back there, in the storeroom. There's a secret switch behind a picture on the wall of the washroom. Just go through the door it opens, and it'll lead you straight to him. Uh-huh. Thanks. What are you doing here? What do you want? I'm here to support you. And I should trust you? Why? What are you selling? Antiques. Golden ones. Things brought in by the refugees. All legit. I have provenance for all of them. 
Why are you back here in a storeroom? Dangerous times. Lots of thieves. Man needs security. You're hiding. Hiding from whom? There's a world of difference between hiding and being discreet. And where do these antiques come from? Inheritances. Grandmother's mantelpieces and farmer's hideaways. A man gets caught selling anything illegal, trading artifacts, he gets in trouble. I deal in antiques. Where does that passage over there lead to? That? That's no passage. That's a storeroom. And you're going to stay away from it. Because it's my business. Why do you think the Don should run the town? He comes from here. He cares for the people, for this island. Those outsiders wouldn't care if this island was washed into the sea. Let's trade. You can trust me. I'm on your side. So, you are the castaway that has been helping my men in the town. I am. Why didn't you say so right away? You've done good work. And for the right side. So who are you? I hear you're someone to be trusted. That you're no friend of the Order and the Inquisition. Neither am I. I look after the Don's affairs in Harbour Town. My job is to know everything, and to lay the foundations so the town will once again be ours. Is there an artifact you're especially interested in? Three, actually. Three very valuable bowls made of gold. They're circulating here in the town. Get them for me and it's worth, say, 600 gold coins. But that's only if you bring me all three. Where are these golden bowls supposed to be? One is being touted for sale in Patty's Tavern. The others, I don't know. My leads have gone cold. What's so special about these golden bowls? A white robe called Carrasco will do anything to find them. Anything the white robes are that interested in must be extremely valuable. And that's reason enough for me to offer a high price for them. How have you been smuggling artifacts out of town? A tunnel. It leads outside the walls. As long as the white robes don't discover the exit, we can come and go unseen. I see. I'll get you these three golden bowls. Good. Once you have them, bring them to me. The Don sent me. I'm to report to him on the situation here. Really? And we need babysitting, do we? Why should I believe you've talked to Don Esteban? Why would I lie? There are a thousand reasons. I proved my loyalty in the camp, rooting out people who weren't loyal to the Don. If you want, ask him. If you've proved your loyalty to him, who am I to question it? So, you will send a report to the Don. He's always keen to know what's going on here. I'll give him a full report. You can take that and a package to the Don. How are you planning to retake Harbour Town? First, we need to have enough resources to drive the order out. When Esteban gives the sign, we'll attack. And largely thanks to you, that won't be too much longer. Just imagine the Inquisitor's face when he finds out. I take it you're no fan of the warriors of the order in Harbour Town? Fanatics. They do what the Inquisitor tells them. No thoughts of their own. That's two reasons to hate them. The Inquisitor could be around for a while. He thinks the world needs him. Which is very regrettable, but we need to avoid an open conflict with him and his warriors. 
for now. So, what do we do next? Someone has to go to the Don's camp and tell the Don about the positive situation here. The Don has been waiting an age for this. Unfortunately, it has taken longer than planned. And telling him is, of course, a job for you. Of course it is. Deliver this package to the camp with kind regards from Scordo. The Don will be pleased. And what will your task be? I'll hold the fort here. Keep everything under control. Here are your three golden bowls. That was a job well done. And here is your gold. You have exceeded expectations. We managed to complete all the tasks you gave us. The Inquisition is losing its grip. The people will see that. They will bend with the breeze when the dawn returns. Well done. Take this as a token of the people's thanks. Carry on and we'll push the Inquisition out and rule as the people of the island would wish. I'll take your package to the Don. Excellent. Here it is. And here is the key for the door over there. It leads to the secret tunnel out of Harbour Town. Don't get caught, or we're all going to hell. And hurry, we've lost too much time already. Then let's not lose any more. Better start again. Did it. About this treasure seeker, the business with Carrasco and the Golden Bowls has been dealt with. You can let the prisoner go. Oh, is that so? I tracked down the people who had the bowls, but they sold them to smugglers, so they'll be miles away by now. Looks like Carrasco failed to stop the smugglers. Are you sure? Absolutely. Well, I suppose there's no point in wasting food on Ulf then. We've more to be worried about than some bowls. Wait here, I'll get him. Hey, send the prisoner out here. The Inquisition is letting you go. Nice work. Can't say I'm sad to be leaving this dingy hole. One hole to another, though. How do we get out of this town? I'll go down to the Harbour Quay and find my brothers. Once you can get us out of town, come and find us. But make sure the way is really clear, okay? We're not too fond of being led into traps. Catch you later. It's you! Hello, Conrad. How's business? You dare to show your face here. I know you were behind it, you and that weasel. What do you mean? You killed my cow. You killed my Elsa. Well, your Elsa wasn't very well protected. You bastard. These are dangerous times. Yeah, and every bastard is just out for what they can get. And you're stuck with me. Here, take your gold. I don't know how you can sleep at night. Just leave, just go. I don't feel like talking. I have some iron ore for you. But what do you want made from it? How much iron ore do you need for a blank? A blank for a one-handed sword takes eight lumps of iron ore. For bastard swords, you need ten, and two-handed swords need twelve lumps of iron ore. Conrad paid up. 
The skin flint made the right decision. Now he's tame, we know where he is if we need to uh, milk him. But if he needs us, well, we'll help him. Only fair. About you escaping town. I told your brothers to come here. Thanks. I appreciate that. Now all three of you are here, you can leave town. Just tell us how, and we're out of here. There's a secret tunnel in the back storeroom of Madame Sonia's brothel. It leads right out of town. Right. We'll meet in the storeroom. Then you can show us this tunnel. See you there. There's a way out of town through the storeroom of Madame Sonia's brothel. Really? Wouldn't have thought that that witless sop would have the guts. She's a woman who likes to keep the bed warm on both sides of the argument. Still, you have the ring of truth, and I haven't had any better leads. I'll meet you at Sonia's. You can show me this tunnel before you can think of any reward. That didn't do it. It worked. Can't do that. Are you stealing? You can't do that. Holt, you're not coming in here. Commandant Carlos has summoned me. I know. I've been expecting you. Then are you going to let me in? Wouldn't be doing my job if I didn't. What's this building? It's our guardhouse, and the headquarters of Carlos, the commandant of the town. How did you become a warrior of the Order? I volunteered. Conscripts usually get sent to the temple ruins after training. I'd rather take guard duty in town any day of the week. They actually tried to make me become a mage. A mage? <laughs> I mean, really? All that messing around with magic. It's not natural.
That wasn't it. Oh no. It broke. There. This text is about magic spells. Ah, finally I get a look at you. I wish I had spoken to you sooner, before you decided to band with criminals. Your talents are wasted with them. Still, your choice is made. Do you have any further tasks for me to do? You have been mentioned in the same breath as the Don's men too often for me. I would be better advised not to get involved with you. That didn't do it. Did it? Better start again. There. About you escaping town. There's the tunnel. Have you checked that it really leads outside? And not into the Inquisitor's bedroom or something? Not yet. Then we'll wait here until you've checked it. Right, so let's see this tunnel. I've checked. The way out of the tunnel is clear. It leads outside the town walls. I'm impressed. And not a question of a reward, yet. I don't have cause to say this often, but thank you. 
I promise. Once I've found what I'm looking for, I'll return the favor. I'm going to head for the beach outside the town, see what I can find. Got to start somewhere. I'll be there for a little while. Just in case you get the urge to look for me. About you escaping town. I've checked it. The path through the tunnel is clear. Okay, let's check it out, boys. Once we get outside, we'll probably make camp on the beach outside the town's walls. So, if you're in the market for treasure seekers, you'll know where to find us. On the beach, right? We'll hit the road now. Good luck with whatever it is you're up to on this island. People have been using the tunnel without my permission. It's not a thoroughfare. It won't happen again. It better not. That tunnel is our lifeline. Yeah, I've got that. Good luck out there. 